Hello guys, today I want to quickly remind you to do this and in fact show you what happens if you don't do this and I see a lot of people don't validate the length of the string and what do you think? For example, if we have a field with 255 characters and we don't do the validation on the back end, what would it do? Trim the ending? Throw an error? Or what would happen? Let's take a look. This is an example of default Laravel Breeze registration form and in terms of database we have a well-known table string which is in fact varchar255 by default so in the actual database we have varchar255 of course you can override it the second parameter to that is you can make it 200 or whatever you want but by default is 255 and then on the back end you have this Let's try to enter the name longer than 255, removing that validation. This is our registration form. Let's fill in all the fields, but rename the name to something very long. And let's make it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0. Already done that actually, but I'll repeat it to you. So 10 characters, 25 times 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, paste. 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and now we are at 250 characters, and finally let's make the final 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. You can see the last characters because of my password manager, but believe me, it's 256 characters. I click register, and what happens? We have an error. That error comes from MySQL, from the database. Laravel just shows that error, so MySQL is shouting at us, I cannot add that value because the data is too long. If we get back the validation rule of max255, what happens then? It's actually the same validation happening, but the error will happen not on the database level and will not show it as query exception, but instead it would have a proper visual validation error. And of course, in addition to that, you can make it a front-end validation. So if you open the register blade and have input for the name you can add max length here max length 255 something like this so that would be the browser level validation not even allowing to type in more characters than the limit and of course this example is quite an edge case so who would enter the name with 200 characters but for other fields with less obvious length be careful and make a proper visual validation errors visible instead of throwing database query exception. If you want more tips like this one, subscribe to the channel. I keep shooting daily videos and you can support my mission by going to laraveldaily.com and subscribe to membership to get premium courses and premium tutorials there. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.